Neighbors are fighting a new housing development that's supposed to nudge right up to the petroglyphs. They don't like the style of the houses. They think the cookie cutter subdivision will ruin the natural beauty of the area. News 13's Jeannie Nguyen is live near Paseo by the petroglyphs with a look at what could be coming. Jeannie. Kim, the developers want to fill these 20 acres behind me here with houses, but the people who live nearby believe they need to come up with a better plan. The monument area is very sensitive. It's a beautiful landscape uh, near the volcanoes. That's why developers at Consensus Planning are looking to cash in on the area right next to the Petroglyphs Monument, not too far from Volcano Vista High School. They're looking to build houses. They, they want to bring in a residential subdivision uh, for, for that particular area. People who live in the area say if they start to build homes back here, one of the major problems is that it'll interfere with this view right there. We want to highlight the views and we want to also, you know, design the subdivision so that they look attractive next to the monument. But Renee Horvath's issue isn't with building homes in the area. Consensus planning asked the city to allow them to build more two-story homes than usual, build them taller than usual, and to make the lots smaller. The city's Environmental Planning Commission approved the request. The Planning Commission felt like that, that the criteria was met, that the variances should be approved. But Horvath says this would just create an undesirable cookie-cutter neighborhood. It doesn't really highlight that you're next to a, a monument area. It just means that you were only focused on getting the most density into a site. The EPC's reason? They believed none of these changes would affect the surrounding neighborhoods. They enjoy their views and, and they like the openness. You know, if you crowd two stories together on these small lots, it just it just looks like a canyon. That's why the West Side Coalition of Neighborhood Associations has sent an appeal to the EPC asking them to reconsider granting these variances to the developers. Now the appeal will go in front of a hearing officer next month. If the hearing officer rules against the EPC, it will be up to city council to decide. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Jeannie. Now we did put a call into the developers to see if they had anything to say about the neighborhood complaints. We did not hear back.